Sometimes, it's the little things that have the biggest effects. Soot is one of those little things. It's released when wood, coal and diesel fuel is burnt. In Northern Europe, most soot comes from unfiltered diesel engines. Soot forms a dangerous part of the particulates in the air we breathe. It can cause illnesses like asthma and lung cancer. In Europe alone, more than 300,000 people die every year from the effects of soot. The health of the planet is also affected. Carried on the wind to the Arctic regions, soot forms a thin grey film on the surface of the ice. The ice is prevented from reflecting the sun's rays as effectively and it melts faster. If we don't act now, in 40 years' time the North Pole will be underwater. For Arctic species, the polar ice caps are becoming very dangerous ground. This melting of the polar ice caps only accelerates global warming. And because sea levels will rise, our coastal cities risk flooding. Storms, floods and droughts will become more frequent. Along with CO2, these tiny particles of soot are the main cause of rising temperatures. But here's the good news. Reducing soot will have immediate effects. That's because these black particles only remain airborne for a few weeks. As soon as particle filters are fitted to diesel engines, soot doesn't even see the light of day. In cars, trucks, buses, locomotives, ships and construction machinery. Unfortunately, most of these still lack filters. So, politicians, industry and we as citizens have to fight to stop soot. That way we deal a blow to climate change and all of us can breathe freely again. Support the fight against soot at www.rusfry-foyers-clima.de slash international.